Should I begin? Hi, my name is Rajesh Gawande and uh, at the outset I would like to uh, thank our host for today, Sushant Jabare, uh, the owner of Amitri 24 for having us here. Uh, the experience was great today, the food was fabulous and uh, the, the company was outstanding. It's, it's a great place to have brunch to let your hair down with uh, like-minded people, with friends and generally have a good time. Uh, the drinks were quite good. Uh, my personal favourite of course was a mutton preparation called as uh, mutton nagi. I, I thoroughly enjoyed it and uh, uh, I think the ambience is also very relaxed, the music is good. So overall it has been a, a good afternoon, a day well spent um, at least uh, for me. So what did you say about the uh, business venture you started out and how did it, uh, what was the challenge and how did it started out? And what Yeah, so this is my first time on Avatry 24 and uh, uh, the best thing about this place is uh, the ambience. The ambience is so warming and uh, apart from that uh, we love the mocktails, I try the mocktails, the mocktails and, uh, and the food, especially the food, the biryani. I would recommend everyone to try the biryani and especially the Nalli Nihari which was something that uh, really got my attention. Um, uh, I would uh, especially recommend this place for uh, a Sunday afternoon brunch because that's the time I came in here and uh, it made my day. Yeah, I'll say that. Thank you. Any particular USP of the place? I mean, anything particular USP you find? The most selling point. The most strong point. So, you do that? I'll do that. Yeah. yeah. So, uh, I, I've been in this in this area of Vira Desai Road, and one thing I know about this place is that it's it's a commercial space uh, uh, wherein you know there are so many corporates always coming down here. And apart from that, uh, people, people after their time at work and you know, having that stressed out life, I believe that this place is going to relax all of them for sure. I think uh, to add to what he said, uh, the location of the restaurant is, is very central. I think it's uh, very well accessible from any part of Mumbai that you are, especially if you are from the suburbs, it's, it's uh, very easily located. Uh, parking is not a hassle here as you would find in, in several other crowded locations. And of course uh, the service here is great. You, would, you have a very cheerful staff, uh, a very courteous staff. And I think that's uh, one of the biggest USPs of this place. Is that all? Thank you. Thank you. I am Prince Prince Bulla and uh, I'm a music producer. Today was my break day from all my work. I couldn't find a better place than this beautiful place. I like the ambience here. It's a very lovely atmosphere. Uh, the service also is outstanding, very quick service and the food is very tasty. We had a good time with our friends here, come and enjoy every meal. Uh, I like the starters, the cocktails, and uh, I think it's a great atmosphere, especially to find something in this locality. It's impossible to find this kind of space, this kind of breadth and good food. So I would, I would uh, definitely recommend this place to some people around. Sir, what did you say about this place, about the quality of food, about the stuff, and about the ambience as such? So, hi, my name is Gwyneth Hyde, and I'm a business entrepreneur. Hu. So, मेरे जो meetings रहते हैं, most of my client meetings मैं यहाँ ही करती हूँ, because I love the ambience. So I bring all my clients here. I I know the food is great. I know I will have a great ambience. I know I will be able to close my deal better. So I love this place. And today is a nice day where we are all coming for some Punjabi kind of cuisine, Punjabi afternoon. So यही इंतजार है कि अभी लाइव म्यूजिक भी रहेगा, so we'll enjoy together and have a great moment. What do you say, Piyush? Yeah, sure. Well, I am Piyush. Uh, uh, my background is like I have a pan Vero Pop ice cream brand. And, uh, uh, this is nice, nice concept they have come up with. I believe it's a, a, a Sunday the brunch and today's a, a Punjabi afternoon uh, brunch scenes. Uh, last Sunday was uh, Halloween scene, so they have come up with a nice concept of you know. The, this concept usually is uh, abroad only, so every Sunday we have come up with some different, different concepts. Uh, 
today is a great culture. I mean, great food, I must say. Like, like mutton and uh, some delicacies are very, very tasty. We have the live counters over here and uh, uh, maki roti, sasam saag. These, these things uh, uh, usually tempt a lot of people. So it's a good thing. Uh, and over, obviously, sitting with friends is, is a good thing. It's a good idea. Yeah. Right. Thank you. Next one. I think this is beautiful. I love this place. I've been quite often to this place. The ambience is perfectly beautiful. If you see, it's very well decorated. Everything is so, so great. And I think I love to spend my afternoons here. And night I can come with my friends and enjoy the you know clubbing feel of it. So it gives a very chill vibe. And food is amazing. Food is really, really good. Uh, I love shisha, so I try shisha also. It's really nice. And uh, what do I say? The food is uh, like, I am a foodie, so I have to be on a diet half of the time. But I do enjoy food here a lot. Like, because they give me very nice kebabs and you know, uh, taste really well. I really tried the biryani right now, which was very, very tasty. So, yeah, a good food and a good place and good ambience to come. And what's uh, going on professional front working on a project right now? Yes, I am. I have, I, I'll be going on floor with a web series called License. So I'll be shooting in a couple of days. And uh, I have a couple of songs coming up now. And uh, yeah, that's about it. Thank you. So we've recently relaunched this place and uh, we are doing a Punjabi menu today. Uh, this was a theme that we've set up for Sunday brunch. And apart from it being a brunch buffet, we've tried and put it up as an a la carte. So people can choose what they want to eat. So what do you say, I mean, what is the main USP of this place? How the food especially? What is the thing that no other place offers as such? We obviously have to maintain the quality and the taste in terms of the food. So obviously we're maintaining the uh, quality and the taste also. We've got a bunch of chefs who are working behind me, behind the cameras. So, uh, yeah, they are the holders of all of this, basically. So, what is your big problem? It is like your, uh, whatever the, uh, the cuisine we have, what we have said, it is all about the international cuisine. Even we are come up with the sushi grill menu. Even uh, we have some nice grill items and sushi items which is coming. Thanks to Chef Emmanuel and his team that he is, they are creating a nice stuff and creating a nice vibe to the Andheri outlet at MSN24. Uh, we are developing more on cuisine where we can give a nice grill items including sushis and a uh, lot of stuff. Yeah, right? so we've got a robato yaki which is a Japanese griller. So we've got that. Now we've, we're going to launch that in another few days. We are starting sushi and uh, also we've got Asian cuisine, we've got dim sum and stuff. So that, this is basically a multi-cuisine place. A nice fusion outlet. Right. Thanks to... Yes? There is a lot of competition in the market also. So how do you want to differentiate with the fusion? Can you experiment with anybody? So we are experiencing a lot of brunch as we did a, a Sanskritic brunch on Diwali occasion. As we did a Halloween brunch. Uh, on Right now we are doing a Punjabi brunch where the, we are catering everybody who was the Indians. Those who are from Punjab, they can come and enjoy. The same way we did with Maharashtians and the localites, and uh, same we did with a Catholic family like your Halloween brand. The Halloween brand. So, what are the other brands you have to your hospitality? Even we have uh, two more brands uh, like uh, Amethis, it is in Andheri, and Amethis XCI, which is in Big Shandy. And all credit goes to Mr. Sushanji Zavre, our owner, and our MD. Talking about other two branches, what are the strengths over here? Uh, the two branches are uh, like your clubs, the hardcore energy club where uh, the crowd flowing, Fridays and Sundays are jam packed, Sundays are totally good. Even we are trying for a new new events like uh, back to school, like we are doing uh, a Saturday uh, house parties that way. Can you add something about the food, about the restaurant? So I would obviously request people to come and try the cuisine that we are serving. Which one? Out of the country. Uh, yes, yes. We have one. another brand is coming up. It is uh, in Dubai. The name will be soon announced. It will be 51,000 square foot indoor arena. It will be a big, huge, huge, huge grand opening will be happening in 
this year. Thank you. The vibe definitely that goes without saying is a fantastic, it has a fantastic vibe and uh, of course the food, uh, it, it's, it's fab. About the ambience, about the staff members and all the Staff is amazing because obviously I have been like uh, a part of uh, Emily's family, you can say it's been like my second home. So and obviously so that's how like the staff basically yeah they, they are very too good. And what's going on professionally? So I am a lawyer basically and I am largely into uh, research. I work with uh, Nielsen India and yeah that's all. So, my name is Sushan Ji Zabre. AVGS's group is a group company where we have a vertical called Hospitality, AVGS's Hospitality. And uh, we were rocking Mumbai with this nightlife. Uh, we had our products as Amethyst and Amethyst XC and Rich Candy. So, this is a different expansion in a food, food venture called as Amitrine 24, which has got multi cuisine. Uh, restaurant booked with the Japanese menu as well and a high-end bar. So you must have researched a lot regarding this business as such. So what was the challenge and what was the which really makes this quite inspiration to start this business as such and being so young and getting the success. As, as you such. see the trend is changing from the nightclub towards it's, it's more of a lounge bar concept trending in Bombay and across the globe. So that is the reason I thought of expanding in this and the challenges are part of life. They keep coming, but that's what motivates you to grow more. Are you planning to start overseas also in Dubai and other Yeah, which I will reveal it uh, very soon. And about the kind of response you are getting from the people, the film industry is here, about the celebrities are coming over here, events happening, about all this kind of stuff. Yeah, they are they're actually uh, all the film fraternity friends, they are loving the vibe, they are loving the place, and uh, there is too much demand of the place for the shoot also. So yeah, we are balancing between that. It's a great responsibility you have lying on so many people coming over here. So what is the, how you manage this taking this responsibility? So I, I'm, I'm actually, I would say I'm a multitasker, but then I'm blessed with the uh, with an amazing team, such experienced people in the hotel industry, in the hospitality industry, and the PR industry. I'm blessed with them. So all the credit goes to my team. Excellent. You want to add something about the people who are party lovers? You want to add something about it? Thank you. Thank you.